everyone, in this video I'm going to be unboxing the March Geek Gear Wizardry box and the March Geek Gear Wizardry wearable box. If you're interested in either of these subscription boxes, I'm going to leave all the information in the description box. And if you use my code POTTERTHINGS20, I'll save you 20% off. So let's get started with the regular box. So once you open the box, oh, you have a little card that shows you who packed your box. So thank you, Leslie, for packing my box. That's a new little detail that they're doing. So let's start with the t-shirt, which I can already tell it's a chocolate frog, and I love all things chocolate frog. We have a cute little chocolate frog on it. Usually I'm not a fan of white t-shirts, but if the design's super cute, I'll wear it. And the design is super cute. I love the design. Oh, a little, I love chocolate frogs. There's so many like little boxes. I don't know which one to pick. Let's do purple because we just did chocolate frog. So we have a chocolate frog box. That they're packaging. That is so cute. And let's try to open it. But it's already kind of broken anyway, so it doesn't really matter if I rip it. Though I love the packaging and I don't want to. Oh, so we got little chocolate frog treats. Let's open it up so we can see the chocolate frogs. I really shouldn't be eating chocolate. I've just been trying to diet. And it looks like uh, there's four of them in each pack. So there goes my diet. <laughs> but that's cute. I love the packaging of their little treats. So I guess they're going to be doing treats now. I love edibles. So I'm cool with that. The next box... Oh my gosh, it says magical potted creature. In this spoiler from, from the last booklet, it had a mandrake. So I'm thinking this is a mandrake. And it says, warning, whenever this plant is unearthed, it screams. The scream of this plant when it is fully grown will kill any person who hears it. But a young plant's screams will usually only knock a person out for several hours. It is advised when handling this plant that you wear adequate ear protection. <laughs> well, I don't have any earmuffs, but I'm ready to be knocked out for several hours. <laughs> so, oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this. It's a little mandrake. I love like replica sort of items like this. I've never seen anything like this. I've, I've always wanted, um, oh, I always wanted a, a little replica of a mandrake. They come out with like pots sometimes, but I think only Etsy does sort of this thing. But oh my god, look how cute that is. And it's like weighted and the detail is so adorable. I love this. This is my favorite item that I've ever gotten in any subscription box. That is too cute. Oh my gosh. I love that. Good job, Geek Gear. That is amazing. The next little box is Wizardry Tea Strainer. We've been getting teas in these boxes and I just bought a tea strainer because of that. But now I have another one and it looks just like the one that I bought. But it has little looks like green for Slytherin maybe and a little owl at the bottom there that is such a cute little detail this one's way better than the one that I bought because it's a Harry Potter one and you know just a basic little tea strainer which will come in handy because they put teas in here now which I'm totally into and where is the tea for this month here we go it, it, ooh, divination tea. I personally love the teas that they've been putting in these boxes. I mean, I'm a big tea drinker, so maybe that's why. But even so, the packaging is so adorable. And I love putting them in my kitchen and kind of Harry Pottering up my kitchen that way. And it even has a little crystal ball there. The labels are so cute. And this one has black tea, lavender, cornflower petals, and bergamot oil. Did I say that right? I don't know. But I love black tea, so I've noticed that you can open it up from the top instead of just ripping it so I can show you what it looks like inside. It's very pretty. I don't know if the camera's gonna even see in there, but I don't feel like pouring it out <laughs> and getting it everywhere. It'll probably spill all over my bed. But it smells very strongly of lavender, which is kind of calming. <laughs> but I'm a fan of the tea. Next, we have a poster, it seems like. And 
Oh my gosh, this poster is so beautiful. I love chocolate frogs, like I've said since we've already gotten other chocolate frog items in this box, but I love, this is so cute. This is a lovely poster and it's like thick too. I really wanna get this framed. And it even has a little signature from the artist. That's nice. That's a pretty poster. And then the last item is another print and I actually have this same exact design that's hanging up on my window right there and I'm staring at it right now. But it's a banner and this is just a print. But I do like this design. I just don't understand the yellow in it. My banner has it too. I guess they wanted a pop of color because it's like a neon yellow. I would think it would have been really cool if it was like red or something just because I, th I think I've seen more Slytherin designs with red in it. It gives it a more darker vibe, I guess. The neon yellow, I don't know, it's kind of cartoony, whimsical, too light for Slytherin. I don't know, but I do like it. <laughs> And then we have some papers at the bottom here. That's it. So, oh, what is these? A Geek Gear Scratch card. That's new. Scratch and win. Ooh, let's scratch. I'll use my long nail to scratch it. No, I didn't win nothing. It says no win, better luck next time. But that's fun, that's a, that's new. So that, that'd be fun to do every month. And then if you win, you email them to claim your prize. I wonder what the prizes are. That's fun. I love scratch cards. And then we have the letter and it says, whoops, we forgot to put this beautiful signed artwork by Paul Tonner on our leaflet. We do apologize your geek gear team. And then we have some advertisements, I'm assuming. I'm actually going, that's going to be my next video. I have the uh, You've Been Accepted box and the limited edition box. So I don't have the ourselves one. I have the first one, which was themed Hogwarts Express. So I'll be opening those two boxes in my next video. But yeah, we'll talk about that in that video. So next month's box hint is the mark, the scar, and my favorite item this month, hands down, has to be the mandrake. That is the coolest thing ever. I love that. And I like that they're putting treats in the box, even though I shouldn't be eating treats, but still cute nonetheless. Comment down below and let me know what your favorite item was this month, and let's move on to the wearable box. Okay, so here is the wearable box. First we have the spoiler card and Darren, thank you for packing my box. So first we have this, looks like a bandana. Oh, that's a pretty, pretty design. Look at that. Look at Hagrid, the Hogwarts Express. That is so nice. I wonder how I would wear this. I would want to wear it like a headband, but if you rolled it up, you, would, you wouldn't you would see the design so much. So I might just hang this up on my wall because the design is gorgeous. And, or it could be like a scarf. You can tie it around your neck. And it has a little signature there for the art work. The artist, I mean. But that's beautiful. I like that. And we never got a bandana from Geek Gear before, so I like that they're changing it up instead of it being shirts all the time. Next we have a white shirt. Well, long sleeve shirt and that is dark. <laughs> it is dark follower. Mm, not sure I like this design so much. At first I thought it was a clown because I just saw red and then it looked like a red nose and I was like, I don't like clowns. <laughs> But, yeah, I'm not, I don't know if I like the design so much. Maybe if it was on a darker colored shirt, it's just so pow. I don't know. The, the skull, it looks like a skull. It's kind of a weird color. Hmm. I don't know about that. But 
Yeah, I don't know about that. That's creepy. Uh, next shirt we have is, it is important to remember that we all have magic inside us. Now that's cute. I like that. Let me move the box because it's annoying me. <laughs> that's a cute shirt and it I like the saying of it. It's, it's inspiring. And the last shirt is another black one which I'm into. I prefer the black shirts over the white ones. Uh, but we have Newt Scamander and he's surrounded by some beast. And I like that Newt is simple looking. He doesn't have his face details or anything like that, which I'm a fan of. So I do enjoy this design. I think this might be my favorite shirt this month. And the bandana is so beautiful. I can't wait to put this up on the wall because it's just like, it's a nice little art piece to be honest. That's nice. And then we have some, oh, then we have, um, the print is the same from the regular box and we have another scratch card. These are fun. No win, better luck next time, but <laughs> I think these are exciting. So the hint for next month will be a house-related item, which house-related items are usually my favorite, so I'm excited for that. And I already told you what my favorite items were this month, the bandana, which is beautiful, and the Newt Scamander shirt. Comment down below and let me know what your favorite item was, and thanks for watching!